I'm Guy. And you're Brayden, right? Brayden after good? I'm not supposed to talk to you. Why not? Because my dad says we're probably just some unemployed bum trying to steal the prize money that I deserve. And that you're a cheater. He said that, huh? He did. It is a noun. Can you tell your dad that I don't blame him for being so angry? And then can you do me another favor? Can you give these to your mother? She left those in my room last night. I would do it myself. But your dad is here. We've already covered his mood. I don't want to kick the nest. Do you know what I mean? Oh, buddy, good luck with that divorce. They get so nasty. What are you talking about? I'm talking about probably a very dysfunctional marriage. I'm glad I was there for her. It's just animal instinct, too, you know? She can't help it. She's just human. Okay? And she was very sweet. I want you to know that. She held me afterwards. A nice woman. That is correct. Hey! You're up, dog. Boy, intelligent, you've got my boat. Next up, we have probably one of this year's strongest competitors, Braden Aftergood. Oh, yeah, that reminds me, well, my very first spelling bee. I had my lucky bottle cap in my back pocket. It looks like he's got his good luck hanky there. <laughs> Noctivigant. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, definition? Going about in the night. Night wandering. Noctivigant. Noctivigant. Oh, wait, can you use it in a sentence? The Noctivigant alley cat kept the entire neighborhood up all night by sitting on a fence, yowling out to her many suitors. Noctivigant. Okay, noctivigant. N O C T I V I G A N T. Noctivigant. 